Hi guys, this is the Device Pro, and today I want to show you guys how to get past these screens in Windows 7, XP, and even Windows 8. I'm pretty sure this works on Windows 8 too. So, as you can see, I type in anything and the password's incorrect. And I'm going to show you how to get past that without changing the password, like if you want to go on somebody else's computer without them knowing it, you could do it. So, let's get into it. So if you want to bypass the password screen on a Windows 7 machine or Windows 8, all you have to do is download the files that I'm going to give you in the description. And you have to have a flash drive too, or a CD. CD will work too, but it's going to be a little bit slower. Uh, you're going to have to burn it and go through that process, which I'm not going to get into right now. So, that being said, I got a SanDisk... 16 gigabyte flash drive and it's gonna work perfect for this demonstration and it's really reliable I love SanDisk and let's do it so all you have to do is just plug in your flash drive go to my computer go to your flash drive mine is H uh, right click and format you wanna format it into a FAT32 put this um, name it whatever you want it doesn't matter quick format and start mm, okay by doing this it's going to delete everything on your flash drive so be careful I warned you when it's done you should get this message that format complete click OK close out of everything now go to your files that you downloaded and if you're gonna do a disk click this and if you're gonna put on a flash drive uh, open con USB open it go to con boot install double click that and it found two drives so my drive is H that's my flash drive right here so I'm gonna type in H and enter and con boot loader successfully installed go ahead and click enter it's gonna exit so that's all you have to do go ahead close out of everything and you could delete these files now they don't really matter unless you're gonna do it again so let's get to the hacking part so you're supposed to go up to your victim's computer and as soon as it turns on you're supposed to click F9 or F5 on my computer it's F9 because that's why boot into things like I'm supposed to boot into this sand disk flash drive um, but on your computer it might be different so you have to google it or check somehow but you're supposed to get into the boot menu and on my computer all you have to do is click F9 so here you go I'm turning it on clicking F9 and as you see I got into the boot menu so I have to scroll down to my SanDisk Cruiser Glide and click enter on your computer it will be different I guarantee it but make sure find your flash drive and click on it um, just wait don't do anything until this screen uh, this screen click enter that's it and con boot is supposed to load as soon as that screen goes away and you see this screen it says starting windows you can take your flash drive out and do whatever now your computer will boot without a password and all you have to do to disable this is restart the computer and it's gonna reset everything so as you see here now I have to type in the password I can just click enter and it will log in It might be a little slow, so just have patience. And there you go. That's how to hack a Windows 7 PC.